Hello guys, my name is Adarsh Raman and welcome back to another brand new video on Click Tracker. I know it's been a long time since I've actually posted a video, so I hope all you guys have been safe throughout these times. In this particular video, we're going to be having a look at what has happened to live cricket uh, since the coronavirus uh, pandemic took over the entire world and it basically has led to a lot of problems. But let us see what has happened in the world of cricket. Alright, let's quickly start off with the local T10 competitions. The first of this is the Taipei T10 League. And this league actually started on the 25th of April and ended on the 17th of May. It is already over and you can catch all the highlights of this T10 competition on Crick Tracker social media platforms. The next league that is in place, that is in progress, is the Vanuatu Blast T10 competition. And this competition has already started on the 21st of May and you can catch all the live action if you want to on Crick Tracker's YouTube channel. The third one in this list is the WinC Premier League that is also in progress at the moment and you can catch the live stream of this particular league on the fan code app. The last one on this list is the ECN Czech Super Series, the European Cricket Network Czech Super Series. It starts on the 13th of June and you can catch all the live stream on the fan code app. Alright, moving on to international cricket, if we have a look at the ICC T20 World Cup, that is the biggest event of this year, uh, it looks like the ICC has decided to postpone the ICC T20 World Cup to 2021. It was scheduled to happen in the October-November window, but now it looks like it is going to be postponed. And the official statement from the ICC is uh, scheduled to come out next week. Right, South Africa and India, the respective boards, have decided uh, that South Africa will host a three-match T20I series in South Africa at the end of August. Uh, Cricket Director of South Africa, Graham Smith, and the BCCI President, Sarah Gangli, had a teleconference call and they decided that they're going to have a three-match T20I series and that is likely to happen at the end of August. Pakistan was all set to tour England for a test match series, but because of this pandemic, that didn't happen. But even now, the Pakistani team is very eager and very excited to tour England and play the test match series without expecting that the English team would come to Pakistan uh, and, and play a test match or a one-day series there. And finally, England and West Indies are most likely to meet at a test series and that will be starting on the 8th of July. That is what the news is around. Bowlers have started to prepare for this. There are actually new bowling guidelines that have been released by the ICC, which I will cover in a later video. So if you guys like this video, hit the like button, comment on however you felt about this video. And if you like it, please do share it. And without fail, follow and subscribe to Trip Tracker.